Hiya! Thank you for joining me here today. Today I'm going to be covering off another Fashion Friday, but for today I'm kind of recycling a couple of things because I wanted to see if they work. So in a previous Fashion Friday video I had talked about these nice shoes and I've also talked about this dress. I'm kind of interested in whether the two actually can go together because these shoes are fabulous. I'm not sure how well they go with the, let's say, this style of dress. And I figured that what I would do today is actually talk about something slightly different, which is hair. Now, I'm currently growing my hair, not because I want to be able to, let's say, dress and go out full time as Juliet or anything along those lines, but I am growing my hair because it's something that my wife asked me to do. I used to have a sort of grade five typical buzz cut, shave it off on top, shave it off at the back and sides. And my wife's always been interested in me having slightly longer hair. I used to have much longer hair when I was younger, I used to have hair down to my shoulders. And I figured I'd try to start growing it out a little bit. It's getting to the point now where you can actually style it in kind of short, styles and styles which are potentially quite nice for going out without a wig. And I thought I'd give that a sort of uh, talking point for today's Fashion Friday, really just to see how well it can actually work and how that kind of operates as a style. So for today, I have started out with this kind of rather, um, it's, it's quite short looking sleek, the hair's kind of pulled back over to one side type look. It's still very short at the back and sides because it always will be. That's something I quite like. I quite having quite like having hair that's quite short at the back and sides. But I figured I would sort of look at this from a, um, uh, let's say more of a, a close-up perspective. So talking about hair. So let's talk about hair. Now, as you can see, I've styled my hair to be quite sleek, quite sort of swept over to this side for this evening's look, kind of pairing it up with some nice sparkly, silvery, jingly jangly stuff. So, you know, it all looks to me quite feminine at least. And I think it's getting to the point where it's, it's sort of quite interesting. Um, what I like about the hair is that my hair, I don't know if you can see this, but as I sort of pull this look apart, my hair is getting reasonably long. You know, it's probably, I guess, four, four to five inches long now. And once it's kind of swept back, it can get a bit sort of bigger and more voluminous. And I'm sort of interested in whether this works as a style, particularly how well it goes with this style of dress, because dressing up and wearing short hair is quite an interesting statement to make when you're going out. But I figured I'd, you know, I've been doing videos with short hair quite a bit recently, but I figured I'd try and sort of have a look at how this works and how different styles can can apply because it's it's sort of getting to the point where you can sort of style it a bit and try to do stuff with it. I don't know, I'm just playing with it at the moment. The thing about my hair is that it's extremely wavy. So left on its own, my hair is going to just go massive. So I have to have quite a lot of product put into it to be able to keep it sort of generally looking reasonably decent. And the more I play with it now, you'll see the bigger, the bigger it gets as it's sort of getting larger and larger, as you can see. So the more I play with it, the more I sort of get into it the more it goes kind of, yeah, interesting and crazy. Um, and I'm just sort of wondering what to do in terms of styles and what to, to do with it as I, as I grow it longer, because eventually it's gonna sort of fall over to the sides. I'm still gonna keep the sides always sort of very short. So I'm keeping the sides and the back very short, but I quite like the way it's getting to a, I guess a sort of tomboy style of, of look these days.
one of the one of the sort of people I follow on Instagram is Penold, Penelope, and her hair it's short. It looks fantastic. It's very short on the side, kind of similar length to mine, I would guess. It's obviously very different in terms of its manageability, but um, I really love the way she has her hair and it's fantastic. So I'm looking at this to think, what can I do with this in the new year? How can I sort of, you know, do different things and, because it, it will not, look at that, look, it will not come forward. It's always got to go back at this length forward and it's just going to go wavy and quite silly so it has to go back but it's getting sort of biggish i'm wondering whether to take it shorter at the sides actually take it shorter even further up here to leave kind of less on top because at some point i'm going to be able to mohawk this you know at some point i will be able to mohawk it and that is something i'm quite looking forward to because it will get there eventually because of the short back and sides, I might be able to, to mohawk it at some point. It won't do it today because of this product that's in it, but I have a better product I can use. Anyway, so that was really the video for today. It's about hair, fashion, your own hair, etc. Um, I'm gonna keep growing mine a bit longer. I'm not sure how long it will get to, but it will get to a pretty decent kind of length. And I'm, I'm kind of interested in how close I am to being able to wear it out. One of my things for 2019 is I've kind of made up my mind that at some point in 2019, I'm gonna go out with my guy hair, even if it is still short like this, because why not? It's kind of the next thing to do. It's, it's the thing I'm thinking of doing next. Let's put it that way. The next thing to be more normalized, more out, more out and about and, you know, doing different stuff. Anyway, so that's something I'm thinking about for 2019. Really looking forward to that. Should be good fun. A um, bit of a different one for this Fashion Friday, I guess. Quite different. But um, yeah, just thinking about ways in which I can do something with this. Any comments, any questions, any suggestions, do let me know in the comment section down below. Obviously, I'm kind of limited on how fast I can grow this, but I'm not getting it cut. So it will continue to grow throughout 2019. And yeah, we'll have to see how it goes in the, in the short term. I... Had to cut my nails, so I'm back to wearing false nails. And they were getting too long, and I'd made an agreement with my wife that after the Christmas parties were ended, I would cut my nails. So I'm back to my normal nail length now. I'm back to false nails. But yeah, the hair is going to keep growing, and yeah, we'll have to see how it goes. So thank you for watching this video. If there's any comments or questions, please let me know in the comment section down below. Or you can reach me through my email address, which is julietisnoir at gmail.com, or through my website, julietnoir.uk. I look forward to talking to you all again soon, and as ever, Bye. Bye.